I'm in Essex, girl. Hi, Jess. Thank Hi. you very much for joining us. How excited have you been with the, the new launch of the second um, series? It's of... been really crazy, to be honest. It's been um, a bit of a whirlwind, and it was all like... I never expected the show to hit off like it did. I really didn't. Um, Kirk was like in a photo shoot once, and he was like, oh, like do you know that we're going to be really big? And I was like, whatever, like, no, Kirk, like, cringe, like, thinking no. And then it just went mad, so I was like, oh, my God, it's crazy. It's been really good, though. Did you think the show was going to come, you know, become so popular no, as it did? No, I didn't I mean... have a clue. Like, I really didn't, I didn't know what I was getting myself in for. I just, I knew that it was an opportunity I couldn't turn down because of the band. Like, it was just so good for us. So I did it, but I didn't think it was going to be as big, no. It's gone mad. How much fun was it making the new music video? Really good. That was so fun. We um, it was there was such a nice team of people, and like it turns out so well. I love it. It's wicked. You personally, have you always wanted to be a singer? Um, could you ever see yourself going solo, perhaps, or was it just literally one step at a time? At the moment? Yeah, like one step at a time. Like I'm in Lola, and that's what I've been doing. I was doing that like way before even the show began. Um, like we were in Lola for quite a long time, so that's my aim, and that's what I've always wanted to be. And like, ever since the Spice Girls, I've always wanted to be in a girl band. I mean, like, solo isn't on the cards at the minute, but I just love singing so much, so I've always tried to do it in one way or another. OK, there's a question about your brother Mark. What's he really like? I mean, he's a charmer, right? I mean, Mark is, like, a charming person in real life, I promise you. Like, he's had, like, his ups and downs in terms of women. He might be a bit of a playboy, but at the same time, like, those girls must have let him because if you want to, you know... He's done what he's wanted, wanted to do, basically, and, like, fair play to him. If the girls are going to let him do it, then why shouldn't they? Like, he's just being a man at the end of the day. Um, in terms of him as a person, he's a very kind-hearted person. He doesn't, like, he's very sort of caring and kind, and he's a really nice family man, but they don't really show that side of him, unfortunately, because I think they like playing on the whole playboy part of him. Obviously, he was with Lauren for nine years. Oh, the famous nine years. I mean, sh I mean, your personal opinion, should they get back together, or is it just a case of, look, they just got to move on? I just think that they've got to move on. Like, I don't really think that they work. I mean, I know that there's something there between them and they do love each other and I think that'll go on for a long time, but I think it's obvious that they don't get on and that's why they constantly argue and constantly split up. So I just want him to be happy, to be honest, or whatever it, that means, if it's with her or without her. There's rumours flying around the whole country that other parts of the country are going to do their own show. I mean, oh, yeah, yeah, do you yeah, think I that's think... right? I mean, or should it just be about the one show, Essex? Who knows? I mean, it's up to them. If they want to do it, go for it. But who, it might not be the same kind of thing, because I think that what they did is they found a really... I don't know whether they're unique or funny or specific, but just the, the group of people that they found for the Essex show, it just worked. So I don't know how that would work, but I'm sure it will, because reality shows are just massive now, aren't they? Can you see the series being put on box set in a few years? I mean, yeah, we're like talking about scale like Friends here, out. but... I think I mean, it is out on DVD at the end of this month. So that's, like, that's so cool. How long can the show go on for? Do you think it's gone for years, or...? I really don't know, because The Hills, like, you think, where can it go next? But there's always something around the corner, so you never know. I'm sure that characters will come in, go, like, come in and go as, as it goes along, but I'm sure that it might last for quite a long time, because it's been such a big hit. Thank you very much for your time today, Jess. No it's worries, a pleasure to you. meet you, and uh, good luck with the new series. Thank you. And Lola, Yay. of course. <laughs> I'm in this, girl.